Question 8. A running club has 270 members. There are 25% more men than women in the running club. How many men are in the running club? Okay, this is um, a, a problem-solving question. Uh, you really need to think about it carefully. And I'm going to always... One, one method, there are multiple methods, but one method is to model it algebraically. Um, and the more practice you can get at doing that, the better. So, if I imagine that the number of women in the running club is... I'm just going to put that equal to x. It's not, as I say, there isn't one method for working this out. But I'm going to put the number of women in it as x. So, to model this situation, I've got x. That's my number of women in the running club. Now... I've got 25% more men. So, x. So, what have I got here? 25, so, if I was 25% if more men, then, then I have 1.25 lots of x for my men. Yeah? So, I've got that many women and 25% more than the number of women. That would be a multiplier of 1.25 times by my number of women. That gives me my number of men. And all that comes to 270 members. So I can just simplify this to 2.25 lots of my number of women equals 270. I haven't given you that much space for this. What I would do is I'm just going to continue this working over here. So if I divide both sides by 2.25, and divide both sides by 2.25, so I'm going to just rewrite out what was going on here. 2.25x equals 270. Now I've got x, which is my member, my number of women. Okay, so x equals 270 divided by 2.25. 2 so 270... divided by 2.25, 120 women. All right, so men is must be easy. Men would be the rest of them. So the men would be 270, take away 120, which is 150. So my answer is 150. Now that's just one method. There are alternate methods for doing that. Here's what I can do, though. I can say, look, I'm just going to double check it. If I have 120 women, and I'm going to times by 1.25, that gives me 150 men. 120 plus 150 is 270, which is the whole lot, so I'm happy. Question 8b. 40% of the men and 30% of the women also belong to a cycling club. Work out the percentage of the whole membership that belong to a cycling club. Okay, so I know my number of men, and I know my number of women. So if it's 40% of 150, and I want to add 30% of 120. So 40% so of 140 is just 0 0.4 times 150, and 30% of 120 is just 0 0.3 times 120. Do this on the calculator. One fifty. So that's sixty. And zero point three times by one twenty equals thirty six. So altogether, I've got ninety six people. The whole membership of the cycling club. So ninety six. Now, that's ninety six people. I'm not quite finished. Work out the percentage of the whole membership that belong to the cycling club. Okay, so that it's it's percentage, it's the it's that as a percentage. So again, I'm gonna do need to do 96 divided by my total membership of the club, which was 270. Remember? 
270 members. And I'm going to times that by 100 to turn it into a percentage. So 96 divided by 270 equals times by 100 equals 35.5%. So I'm going to say 35. It's 5 recurring percent, so I'm going to say 0.6% to the nearest one decimal place.